Today I will show you how to create a new user in Fusion. So right now this window is the users list and it is located in Fusion Admin users list users. Um, when creating a user you need to have a contact that would relate back to this username and that is found in Fusion Core contacts and then you could create a new person or a new company. So now I'll show you how to create a new user. So I'm going to click new and select my contact that's related to this user. So um, and then put in your username, your password, um, you, then you can give uh, a permission group. So this is done when you have set up Fusion in your permissions group, which would have been in preferences. Next, you can set that if they can receive messages or can accept license agreements. Um, here is the debug admin access. Uh, there's three options here. So no access is that they have they cannot log on to this window. Restricted access is access will be able to well they, they will be able to access some basic non-harmful functionality in the window and full access means that they can do anything that they please in that window. Uh, next is status. So when an uh, employee leaves the feedlot, you can make this to a non-current status. Uh, users should not be deleted because of the history related with the name. Um, mark their account, they'll just have to mark their account as non-current so Fusion does not lose that history. If you have any questions, you can please contact us or press this little blue button and it will lead you to some documentation on how to uh, go about this. Um, thank you for watching.